Hi, we here at Rainy Day Fabricating would like to thank you for inquiring about the hopper. In this video, we'd like to show you how to install the hopper on your auger, how to adjust the jack for your bin, and how to clean the hopper out after using the hopper. You will want to lift the hopper onto the auger so that the collar on the end of the auger goes through the hole on the hopper. Then, put the strap through the ratchet and tighten until the hopper can't move. With the hopper, you can leave the hopper on your auger all the time, even when pulling the auger down the road. When you get to your bin, pull the factory hitch out to install the jack. You want to set the jack to the correct height before placing your auger under the bin. The correct height is when the hopper belting touches the bin. When you're done using the hopper, it's nice to be able to clean the hopper out. Simply open the door on the bottom of the hopper. Reverse the auger and all you will have left is a half a shovel full of product. Here we have the hopper with a lump buster attachment. We will reverse the auger to show you how much fertilizer was left over inside the hopper. For storing the hopper, we recommend spinning the hopper upside down to keep all the rain and snow out. Simply slide jack to the top hole, loosen the ratchet strap and then turn upside down. <laughs> 